So as you know, division rivals are updating very, very soon. The seasons are gonna be updated, which means you're gonna get, you're all gonna get rewards. You're gonna get three sets of rewards, one for worst attack, one for head to head, one for manager mode. So let me know down in the comment section where you are and what rewards you're gonna get. And also please make sure to like and subscribe, that'll help me out a lot. I'm also gonna open this pack at the end as well. 80 to 94 overall player pack, mixed version player, cause why the hell not, right? It's a free 80 to 94 overall player where we can pack uh, Zico 94 overall, uh, normal Ronaldo, uh, or R9 Ronaldo, I mean, normal Ronaldo, just because he's not a special card, but he's still a 94 overall icon card and any other player card. So yeah, that's gonna be very, very nice. But as I said already, uh, Division Rivals are gonna be updating, are gonna re be refreshing very, very soon, and you're all gonna get rewards for it. For example, if you're in the legendary, uh, if you're in world class one, just like I am, you're gonna get 79 to 88 overall player pack. I'm gonna try to get to uh, legendary three in worst attack and in head to head, definitely. I'm not sure about manager mode I, I still want to play it but i'm not sure if i'm gonna do it you know because i just don't like manager mode still though i might try to get uh, somewhere in there as well but i'm head to head i'm quite close i'm at 654 000, uh fans as you can see i won a couple of matches in a row but i'm way very close to getting uh to the 80 to 94 80 to 89 overall player pack if you are in fc champion though fc champion 3 2 or 1 you're gonna get an 85 to 94 overall player pack so if you grind it enough you're gonna get up to 94 overall player pack that means you have to go ahead and sell all your base cards straight away if you haven't if you've got any of the base cards still in your club you have to sell them because all of those cards are gonna go down in price a lot as you can see right there uh, i don't really have any um any base cards right now i do have silvers of course i might try to sell some of these silver cards as well just because their prices are gonna go down a lot as well but i'm not sure i might sell some of them i might not sell some of them but here we are, if you got any 80 pluses, you have to 100% sell them. I don't have any more bronze players, of course, because I've just made a video um, training up all my players right there. I changed my center back, Bobby Moore with Kim min -Jae, who looks very, very good. And I've played a couple of matches already, and that Kim min -Jae card is actually very, very good in game as well. But make sure you go ahead and sell all your base cards, whatever they might be, 80 overall, 85 overall, 90 overall. I've sold all of them as well. I had Marquinhos, either Militao at Sanji Box. I had a lot of other uh, cards as well. And obviously, I've claimed over 50 million coins as well uh, in my last video. So I've got almost 50 million now because I, I spent, um, what was it, like 4.9 mil, I think, on Kin Min -Jie. But I've still got quite a few coins. Um, and after we get that, if, if you want to get those base players back, for example, if you go Mbappe, and you really really like Mbappe, uh, the Mbappe, Mbappe card, you can go ahead and buy him back after Division Rivals refresh in a couple of days after that uh, and you're gonna be making a lot of coins, uh, a lot of profit with that. If you buy him back in uh, four or five days from now, you're gonna be making some coins because you can buy him for a lot cheaper than what he is right now. He's about 20 million coins now, he's gonna get cheaper and cheaper after Division Rivals update as well as all the other base cards as I talked about before. Um, every single one of them are gonna get cheaper and cheaper because everybody's gonna get those uh, those type of rewards whatever they might be 80 to 89 overall 85 to 94 overall 78 to 86 overall a lot of people are gonna get those packs and not only one each we're all gonna get three each of course for reverse attack for head to head and for manager mode but let me know what you think about that let me know where you are at, uh, as well in reverse attack in head to head and in manager mode which one do you like playing which one do you not like playing i like uh, playing head to head the most to be honest but yeah, I'm a play versus attack as well. Haven't played it for quite a while to be fair, but I'm still gonna try to hit that 700,000 caps and hopefully we're gonna get there. Anyways, let me go ahead and get into the Libertadores challenge mode now and I'm gonna go ahead and open this 80 to 94 overall player pack as I said. So I'm gonna be back after the match and we're hopefully gonna win it. From this challenge mode, we are getting a free 80 to 94 overall player pack and it's such an easy challenge mode to win as well. You can pretty much do it in like 10, 15 minutes because there are only two matches against AI. One, uh, we are at like 60th minute already. And in this one, I think we were like 50th or 55th minute. So you can go on and do all that way very easily. And there are like three other skill games. And this last match was quite easy for me as well, right there, as you can see, 4-1 and the game is gonna end right there. And we're gonna be able to open that 80 to 94 raw player pack straight away. We played against Bolivar. It's one of the South American um, teams, I guess, call me Bolivar Libertadores teams. Anyways, I'm hoping to get, I mean, if I get a walkout 
uh, first of all, that's going to be a good start, right? If I get a workout, that's going to be a good start. Then I'm hoping to get at least a 90 plus. Is that too much to ask for? I think that is, but no workout, right? That's bad then. 80 overall, 80, 80,000 coins, sorry, and 81 overall Al Musrati right there. Al Musrati is still going to get sold just because um, he's going to go down a low in price after Division Rivals refresh, of course. So I'm still going to sell that card, but am I happy? Not really. Um, as I said, though, I'm still going to sell him, not 100, not for 190k for max, because he's still going to sell for 206,000 coins. As I said, was hoping for a bit by one, but it is what it is. I can sell Pabon right now, actually. Should I sell Pabon for 1.1 mil? I think I will save him for now. He's quite decent as well, to be honest. He's quite decent when he plays um, in the second half most, most of the times. This Chiesa card... He's got 100 pace actually, I didn't even realize that. He's good, but he gets tired quite quickly, uh, for me at least. Uh, I use him quite a lot in the first half. And in the second half, whenever he gets tired, Pabon comes on and he actually plays quite well in game. He's got 93 pace, 86 shooting, 4-star recruit as well, and does the job quite quite well to be fair. Uh, I don't need Grealish in my team just because I don't really like him. Uh, Jota, M uh, Mukuku and Pabon, I think, play a little bit better. So those three are my subs. If I'm winning the match, I might sub Bon and Panzu instead of Backham or Gerard. But that happens very, very rarely. Anyways, now I'm going to go out and claim all these rewards as well. As you can see, I'm still claiming my welcome points. I'm still claiming all my welcome points because we will need that. We, we will need those points for the next big event that we're going to get. We can exchange them for the next even points or token, tokens, whatever it's gonna be. And a lot of you want, wanted me to open these packs as well, actually. Um, Libertadores packs, these packs. I'm gonna open them tomorrow, I think. For tomorrow, I might open them. If you, if you want to, please like and subscribe. Um, as well as leave the comment down below if you want to, and I will open them tomorrow. Anyways, this is gonna be the last one right there. I'm gonna claim this free pack as well, and then we will uh, claim those rewards for welcome points two more points and a lot more here of course 12 more as well as 100 gems i always take gems of course i'm gonna claim this as well what the hell not and open uh, maybe star pass packs and i still want to get at least one great pack from uh from star pass packs so hopefully this is gonna be the one for me i think i can open like two or three of those star pass packs we've got some more gems of course i can open two right we're gonna open two and we are gonna try to get some this and nothing from the first one and from the second one we go oh we did get an 80 plus overall this is what i was waiting for i mean i wanted a walkout but from this pack free 300 000 coins right there as you can see look at that man look at that that uh, the other card sold as well and this card alex berenger he's gonna get sold as well for 309 000 coins so there we go free 300 000 coins and free 200 000 coins for almost rati as well Oh, he's not getting sold straight away then, is he? Uh, some people have already bought that, uh, bought that card. Right, he's sold now then. He's sold now. And we've got a, uh, some free, some more free coins. Almost at 50 million coins. Now we'll take that. That's going to be the end of for today. Make sure to like and subscribe. And peace.